A new Spongebob episode reveals mocking Patrick? Which reminds us of a problem surrounding the show that we should talk about. Mocking Spongebob, you can't really go wrong with him. He was introduced in Season 9's episode Little Yellow Book, but it was many years later that the internet started using it for an entirely different meaning. While the original context was merely acting like a chicken, it transformed into mocking others and repeating what they say. Seeing repurposed content like this gives Spongebob a sense of timelessness, which explains why people keep revisiting older episodes. Well, in the new premiere, Pat the Dog, Patrick becomes a worm. I will not be elaborating on that statement. We just have to accept this. But at one point during the storyline, this happens. Cheerleaders split. <laughs> Chicken. <laughs> Chicken Comparing the two poses, you can tell that these are nearly identical to each other. The derpy eyes, the hands placement, and the pointy mouth. Mocking Patrick has become a reality, a long-awaited sequel to the meme that started it all. While it's always fun to see references like these, I also feel like it reveals a problem with the modern generation of Spongebob. Am I the only one who thinks they're focusing too much on the past? They throw in easter eggs here and there, but more recently than ever before, there's been an emphasis on telling jokes or giving poses that we've already seen. One of them that comes to mind right away is Fred, also known as the My Leg guy. It's been a recurring gag since the golden era, but recent seasons have been bringing it back a lot, even giving him an entire episode, which was actually kind of great, not gonna lie. But here's the problem. This is happening way too much. Instead of thinking of new gags, it's just a constant replay of what happened previously. Take, for example, the newest episode of The Patrick Star Show. Fred is once again in trouble with his leg, repeating the same thing. My leg? We know it was you. <laughs> My leg? I would normally think this was funny if it wasn't the 100th time we've seen it. That's only a small example of what I mean, but hopefully you get the idea. Just like Mocking Patrick, the team sprinkles in constant references to old jokes, which can be good or bad depending on who you ask. For me, it's just getting kind of overdone. Then again, this isn't necessarily everyone's fault behind the scenes. SpongeBob is a long-running show. It's hard to think of original jokes and stories all the time. But still, it would be nice if we move on from the past, or at the very least, limit stuff like this. Having references every once in a while is completely fine, but the new seasons just pump them out every other episode. Now, do you think modern Spongebob relies too much on previous jokes, or are you glad to see them coming back all the time? While you think about that, I'll be re-watching the real Mocking Patrick. May I take your hat, sir? May I take your hat, sir? But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and come up below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.